Come on, my viewers, welcome back again, you know. Happy Sunday to each and everyone. From when I see the time, when I know what is it, you know, my viewers. So when I see on the screen, when I don't have to say nothing more. There's a little thing I go around the other day with Jabba's prank. You don't know? Yeah, man, the man comes straight out of down there, you know, my viewers. Out of Mandeville, you know. Popular social media influencer, you know, my viewers. I don't even know so them things are going behind the scenes, my viewers. But as you see the report, we have to make sure we get it. So Jabba's did arrested the other day for some rape charges, my viewers, for him girlfriend. We don't sure what really go on. But my viewers, Jabba's granted bail following rape charges. Popular social media influencer, Nasheen Jabba's Finley, was today offered bail for the sum of 600000 when he appeared in the Kingston and St. Andrew Parish Court. The 28-year-old was arrested on January 28 after he was accused of sexually assaulting a young woman in September of last year. It is reported that Finley was drinking alcohol at the time of the alleged incident. However, his lawyer, Courtney Rowe, today denied the allegation during a bail hearing before parish judge Jacqueline Wilcott. Rowe submit that both parties had an altercation two days before the alleged incident and that the complainant was made against his client out of malice. Finley was subsequently offered bail on condition that he reports to the Kansan Spring Police Station and that he is not to be seen in the community in which the complainant lives. The popular entertainer is to return to court on March the third boy well, my viewers may I tell you no say you know them type of thing you kind of look bad upon the youth still because you know, don't know say yo the youth is a influencer you know, my viewers and him think out oh, there like that yeah man jabba's prank man I only party prank them with we too the youtubers the vloggers them take into more while because you don't know we have to support the love and we have to share the love all around but it's kind of sad more while when you see Things like these pop up in, a, in a the media, you know, my viewers, because you know the media is all about building and breaking people. So at these points, you know, my viewers, you have to be very be careful. You have to be very careful of the things you do as a vlogger who have a face in you know, the media as an influencer to cause influence of whole heap of influence on people, you know, because through them youth, a whole heap of people decide to say, all right. The more I'm going to do the vlogging and all of them things, my viewers. But you have to be very careful on the route where you go or the things where you do because, trust me, we don't even know. Say. But all, and, all of these things, too, you know, my viewers, can be of some differences, too, you know, because the report say he and the female complainant had a little argument two days before. So, in fact, it can be used as a, a mood I say, you know, a comeback against him because in popular name, look at thing there, and they don't know some females, they are them of viewers. One, do them type of thing there for tell some lie on you and them thing there. Because you know, police quick for rush come lock you up and them here say, yeah, you sexually assault a female. But if a female do it to you, you know, my viewers, the police them laugh after you more while. But anyway, my viewers, we give you no more update on it, you know, so blessing to you.